Hey everyone, Greg Taylor from Trinity Web Media. So if you call our Trinity Web Minute or anything that we've done on a new marketing show lately or other Instagram TVs, you know, we talk a whole lot about WordPress, we talk a whole lot about content creation. So today, you know, it kind of it kind of like dawned on me like there are two different ways people are creating content nowadays. You know, a lot of people are creating content based on research, a lot of people are creating content based on observations and hypotheses and experience and best practices and intuition all of that great stuff and I absolutely love that you know we write a lot of articles that are very tactical and very practical when it comes to how to do something why to do something you know the theory and the methods behind it and that's great 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 evergreen content the other type of content that we that I really really enjoy and that I'm drawn to is when people are documenting content you know, somebody like Gary Vaynerchuk is fantastic at documenting content. Tim Ferriss, very, very good at documenting content. And what it happens is it's more of an observation. And it's more of a, hey, I walked down the street and I saw this. And it got me thinking about this. And you're very, very in the moment with that stuff. So I like both styles. I think that there's a lot of value in the former being observing and creating content that way. I think that there's a lot, a lot of value in that because... I, in my mind, I think that that's more evergreen, and what's going to happen is that's going to stand the test of time as long as the platforms stay the same, et cetera, et cetera. The methodology and the psychology of marketing are pretty much always going to be the same, but you have to make pivots based on the platforms to which you're broadcasting. That's important. You have to pivot for each platform based on psychology. Is that alliteration? There's a lot of P's there. But the other way is documenting things. I love documentaries. I love podcasts that tell stories. I love storytelling. So like that's more of the observation and documenting content. So I think it's important for you to do a couple of things. One, recognize which you prefer and what your customers prefer. Two, recognize where you're pushing this content out to and to what platforms and to you know how it's going to be received. And then the other thing and the big thing is what's the goal? Is your goal to point something out and help somebody for in the future, or is your goal to go ahead and educate somebody and have them use it as a resource? I think there's two very distinct ways to create and deliver that. So thanks for watching. Check us out on our podcast, The New Marketing Show, and Instagram TV, YouTube, our, our website. You can also subscribe to that podcast at trinitywebmedia.com slash iTunes. Thanks for watching. See you next time.